The following contest Don't look now, but we got company. We didn't even start the match yet. The fight is on. This is wonderful. Sometimes you have to take what's yours. He's doing that right now. Oh, man. I did not think he would go this far. A kick to the gut. That'll double you over. Well, we're on the move here. The face is absorbing a lot of damage here. I'm not sure I can watch this. This guy's a machine. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. A knockdown drag out brawl, complete with a big stomp. Man, these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. Ow! Ooh. Oh, man, I wouldn't be surprised to see that eye swell up after that. Please join me in welcoming my guest tonight. Let's talk about Kalisto. He ambushed you during your own match tonight. What did that mean to you? That was cute. Does he really think he can get me riled up by attacking me like that? He's still beneath me. Enough said. You two have been clashing a lot lately. Is this turning into a rivalry for you? He's trying to start a war that he can't finish. That's fine. I'm up for the challenge. I just hope he's ready for the fight of his life. This is not just a rivalry for me. He is standing between me and what I want, and he'll soon regret that. There you have it. Back to you, Cole.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Phoenix, Arizona, Matthew Bulldog. What a reaction from the WWE Universe. I can't hear myself think. More great action ahead here on Superstar.
and approaching the ring from Tokyo, Japan, weighing in at 182 pounds, Hideo Atomi. This guy will settle for nothing short of a victory here tonight. Whoa, it looks like he hasn't missed many gym sessions. Singles action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. He's starting to make a statement. Whoa, and a bit of a test of strength here. I love it. This is a good old-fashioned battle of power versus power. How do you sum up Padeo with Tommy's performance as of late? Well, luckily, the body hasn't absorbed too much of an attack up to this point. He's simply reminding him that he's here. Both of these competitors have so much resolve, it's going to take a minor miracle to keep one of them down. Hideo Itami doesn't know what hit him. Thinking to avoid that. No, oh, wait, nice reversal. What a display of unmitigated strength. The ring mat's in pain after that one. Yeah, you're right. I think that hurt the ring and him. Great one-on-one -on -one action here tonight. It doesn't get much better than this. Oh, Hideo Itami is on the move. With authority. Right on a small of the back. For the first time tonight, Hideo Itami getting ready to go high risk. Oh, no! Taking this type of punishment must be damaging to his sternum. Damaging to his entire chest? Oh, man! Cutting off circulation to the brain. You can pass out. from a hold like that. He did it. What a huge win. Look at this. This was a match that was simply mesmerizing. Here's your winner, Hideo Atami. What a phenomenal contest. I can get...
Triple Threat Contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Phoenix, Arizona, Matthew Bulldog Champ. The roar in this building can be heard from the street. The only problem with coming back to Raleigh is the stares I get while in town. It's like these people have never seen a limo before. Jeez. I think it's actually the Longhorns on the hood. I love those Longhorns. And approaching the ring, representing the Lucha Dragons from Mexico City, weighing in at 170 pounds, Kalisto. Wow, what a thunderous ovation from this crowd here tonight. This triple threat match can go any way. It's almost too close to call a favorite heading in. And approaching the ring from Louisville, Kentucky, weighing in at 275 pounds, Baron Corbin. What a reaction from the WWE Universe. I can't hear myself think. Big match for him tonight, but he certainly looks up for the challenge. And here we go in this Anything Goes match. Triple threat matches are so unpredictable. Enemies become allies. Allies become enemies. But in the end, it's every man for himself. Baron Corbin seeks out a big move here. I don't know about you, but Raleigh is by far one of my favorite cities to travel to while on the road with WWE. These fans are so passionate and engaged. You know, Cole, I'd love to sit here and describe Kalisto's amazing offense, but I don't think my words could do them justice. They really have to be seen to be believed. What's your analysis of Kalisto? Got to have that head on a swivel here tonight. You never know where the attack might be coming from in a triple threat match. There's no quit in these guys, but unfortunately only one of them can be victorious here tonight. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. Oh, no. Wait a minute, Cole. What's he going to do here? Like you, King, I have to remind myself to call the action when Kalisto's in the ring rather than sit back and watch in complete awe. You do that a lot, and it's so easy to get caught up in his offense. It's seriously unlike anything we've ever seen before. These guys are giving it their all here tonight, not just to entertain the fans, but to ultimately walk away with the win.
Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. He's doing everything he can to get his bearings back here. Otherwise, this match could be over sooner than anyone could have anticipated. Yeah, Cole, this is when you have to settle things down. Get the blood flowing back in your body and strategize what your next move or your next form of attack will be. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Baron Corbin showing some adversity right now. Oh! Oh, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you could find yourself in a world of hurt. Yep, there's the reversal by Kalisto. After a move like that, he's going to need a chiropractor in his near future. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Cole, what's he got in mind? Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. Oh, out of nowhere! Did you see that? Don't be surprised if you see that move trending worldwide on social media. Yeah, hashtag that move. Not today, too fast. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Now with complete control. Wow, that overhand punch started down behind his feet and just kept coming. <laughs> Man, that came out of left field. Look what's happening in there. I don't know if we've ever seen someone as large as Baron Corbin move like this. The guy's picking up steam, all right. Uh, Kalisto really made a name for himself, competing in his hometown of Mexico City prior to going to NXT in 2013. Whoa, what the? Look at this from Kalisto. Kalisto can create his own momentum so easily that he can amaze an opponent or audience. This is going to leave some scars, Kalisto. Oh, no. Wait a minute, Cole. What's he going to do here? Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. Nothing good is going to happen out here on the floor. Like you, King. I have to remind There it is. The Listo kick. Man, that was devastating. Makes the cover. Wow, there's the save. The match continues. Making it look easy. This is dangerous. Taken now with a belly to back suplex. What a vicious suplex. Good grief. How is he still conscious? will be over in no time. Kalisto may be only 5'6", but he seems to have no problem hanging with the bigger competition here in the WWE. He's 5'6", is because he's standing on the phone book, but his lightning fast pace that disorients the opposition, that's what is impressive. And I get... Oh, my. Baron Corbin. Wow. He's still down after that. Whoa. Don't get up. The most agile warrior in the ring looking to end it with the Salida del Sol. No kidding, this could be it.
We're looking at complete domination here. All these power moves tonight are made. And into the cover. Innocent. They're still alive. Yeah, Cole, you remember that song back in the day? Staying alive? Well, that was it in WWE terms. Oh, wow. He's really done a number on him thanks to moves like that. A terrific reversal by Kalisto. And what a reversal from Baron Corbin. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Kalisto. This might be it. Wow, that was a wild strike. Tell you, I'm missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. Cole, you brought up Kalisto's NXT success. But let's not forget that Kalisto also won his first ever match on the WWE main roster when he and Sin Cara beat Curtis Axel and Heath Slater. Now that's making a statement. Man, this has been a great matchup. You're right about that, Cole. A Matt Classic. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. The back is the largest area on the human body, and thus always a target. I know what you mean. You know I've got a week back. How long did you have that? Well, about a week back. And he gets into the ropes. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. He's showing the heart of a warrior here tonight. I can't tell you how many victims have suffered the same fate. When you're beat up. And here's a cover. And he breaks the three count. Oh, I got to tell you. I really thought that could have been it. Not every move is designed to get the fans off their feet. You could call this a good old-fashioned butt whooping. Yeah, that's exactly what we're witnessing. A butt whooping. Baron Corbin is getting ready here. The end of days, can you say, end of the world? Yeah, it's the end of that guy's world. Two. What a win. Man, he's got to feel great. Oh boy, that was a spectacular performance. Look at this. Let's this take a look back at what I can't believe what we saw in that match. Here is your winner, Baron Corbin. That was a big
The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Phoenix, Arizona, Matthew Bulldog Champ. Oh, I can't wait to see this one. Whoa, looking to be in phenomenal shape heading into this one. Based on the electricity that's traveling through this arena and decibel level of the crowd, I think it's safe to say the roof of this building just might blow off. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. Paying attention to the back now. He looks absolutely unstoppable here. Oh, he missed. Oh, -ho, nobody home that time. Let's talk briefly about Champ. Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. We're going to find out who's the better competitor, that's for sure. No gimmicks here, just some good old-fashioned one-on-one action. The human body can only absorb so much of that. Oh, look at this. Finding a groove here. Quick thinking to avoid that. Trying to build some offense. Since his NXT debut in July of 2014, Simon Gotch has become a major thorn in the side of his opponents. At times, Gotch's style can be considered unorthodox by today's standards, but it's effective nonetheless. Gotch is a throwback to the early days of our business when wrestling was in carnivals. Another way Gotch is a throwback is he lets his actions do the talking for him. Beware of the gentlemanly beatdown.